Hey guys, welcome to the Kel and Rich Show. My name is Kel, this is my awesome husband Rich, and we are here with Donnie. Hello. Donnie is the manager of Count Vamp. Which rock is, and roll, rock, uh, rock, rock, bar and grill. Bar That's and right. grill. Gotta get the amazing name right. Yeah. Amazing rock. It's amazing in here. Seriously. Look at the decor. It's our first time. The guitars, the drum kit on the roof, the attention to detail, the sparkles. Sparkle magic. Oh my god. That's what we got rocking here. A lot of glitter. Rock and sparkle magic. That and leopard print. A lot of leopard print. There was yeah. not a shortage of leopard print. You know what? And a the lot of webs, a lot of sparkles, and the a lot of leopard print. Yeah, Lots a lot of guitars. Of yep. yeah. A lot of outfits. Yeah. If you are coming to Las Vegas and you've never been here, it is well worth the trip. Oh, yeah. Fantastic. We were recommended by Will Harden of the New Messiah. Yeah. And, um, hi, Will. Thanks for letting us know that this place is here. It's been just awesome already. Yeah. So, yeah, well, I just want to just bring everybody up to speed. Yeah. So we're about four and a half miles off the strip, I'd yeah. say. So four and a half miles. Sahara. Yeah, Sahara. And it's really easy to get here. Uh, plenty of parking, you know, you come in and it's definitely, you know that that design has been top shelf. And the sound is, is incredible from the music itself, which is incredible. A lot of love and compassion was put into this place to be the best rock bar freestanding off of the strip. Everything from just even the back wall was made to absorb sound. We got a ton of wattage pumping through that just, you know, you feel it. You feel it come through your uh, heart and your soul and it kicks you right in the chest. So oh, totally. This is built to be a rock club. Oh, yeah. So if you're ever in Vegas, Come on, we'll stop by, and, you know, we'll make sure we take good care of you. Absolutely. And just to, you know, we emailed um, them today for a table, and we got a hold of Brittany, and she, we told her the story of Jared, which we'll tell you in a second, and, um, and she was so wonderful and sweet, and she gave us a table and told us to talk to you. So our channel is built around um, the unfortunate passing of her son. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. He was a major rager in the Canadian metal scene and he's a music musician. Um, so today's his birthday and he wanted to spend his birthday in Vegas. And this was a huge surprise that he had this with his dad and he and I saw this for 18 months. But he passed away in December. He, he was going to jump out of a box, a life size box, <laughs> guitar and all. And I wasn't going to know that he was here. And Kel basically blindfolded me yesterday, threw me in the in the car, transferred me in a van, didn't know what was going on, and all of a sudden, I smell jet fuel, takes the blindfold off, we're at the airport, and she's like, this is what Jared wanted for his 24th birthday, which is about 18 months from when it was hatched, that's, that's today. And she said, we're gonna basically do what he wanted us to do, and we're gonna have to go to Las Vegas for five days. Well, I believe in energy, and I believe Jason's still here. Yeah, yeah. Jared, yeah. Oh, Jared. Jared. Yeah, yeah, no, it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Hard here. <laughs> so he's part of, he's parting with them. Oh, cool. <laughs> I, I believe that Jared is yeah. here, and I believe that he's parting with us right now. Absolutely. Enjoying himself and enjoying you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, when Sonolith was on, I mean, first of all, we had just done our first reaction to Kaius, okay? And Kel had never really, she had never really reacted to, to this music in the genre. And she loved Kaius, a song called Green Machine. And it's filmed in the desert, and it's like I'm reading her about, I'm reading her about desert rock to her, which is a new term for me, I didn't know it was, it was that. Yeah. Desert rock. Desert. Look at that, look at that, he's wearing a shirt. Yeah. So all of a sudden we saw the lineup tonight and we're like, oh my god, it's the last reaction video that we did before we left. So here we are, we have uh, Sacramonte coming up, we have um, Monarch coming up, we have Nebula who's the headliner. And we just, you know, sampled some of their stuff and read, read about their stuff. And here we are. And here we are with Donnie. You know, he's just going to be taking care of us tonight and uh, we'll be coming in and out from the live stream. So hopefully you guys have caught that. Hey John! Yo Gist! Come over here, man. We're talking about Desert Rock. What's up? We're talking about Desert Rock. We're Desert Rock? Yeah, of course. We're doing a little something for, uh, for YouTube. Yeah. I'm John Gist. How you so doing? Let's, let's move this way so you yeah, can yeah, yeah. hear me. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah you're All right. right. Yeah, tell, yeah, this is good. Okay. This is good. I'm going to just check. Okay, so John, my name's Kelly, but you can call me Kel. This is my husband, Rich, and I'm going to get you to move over. 
Chris a little bit. So, Perfect. Okay. John, John books all these amazing talents here that we get that are that are the desert rock scene, and we get a lot of uh, great people in here because of John. Some of we literally from the World First Reaction Channel. Okay, what's that mean? It, it means that we're, I'm showing Kel music that she's never heard before. Oh! Uh, and on camera, she's reacting to this music. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it, and it I came, dig it. It came about from our son passing away, and he was a metal shredder. Oh, and, awesome. And we would go to shows, we'd go to his show. Right, right. And one of the things we did is we reacted together. We'd open up a jewel case, you know, and put it on the stereo and put our heads together. Oh, that's awesome. So what we did is we started this channel. Right. In his memory and all those rocking in peace, and we'd just done Caius. And she had never heard of them, she never heard. Of them. But you knew Caius? Uh, I knew Caius. How do you know Caius? Uh, I'm University of Massachusetts, there was old stone and rock kind of, kind of crowd there. So. I'm East Coast myself. Okay, well, there you go. So, yeah. so, so, we, so, so we got some recommendations. Yeah? The first recommendation was come to Counts. And then I saw Hell the yes. lineup, and literally, this was two nights ago. Wow. He's wearing a shirt. Yeah. You're here. So this is Jared's kind of spirit in action, you know, putting the put right all of us together and um, what a genre. So like, can you tell us like who right now like, where where are these guys in the genre? Let me tell you what's going on here. There's three strains of what they call heavy psych that's going on tonight. Heavy psych. Oh like God, literally three different strains of it. And so this one right here is gonna a monarch is gonna have a very glowing. There's gonna be it's a little more laid back, a little more melody to it. Um, it's awesome, stony, great, cool music. Sacramento's up there. It's like amped up, like doors on fucking coke or something. <laughs> with some layers, which they already were. It's weird, but maybe they were on think. But and it, and it, it's got these great layers and. They hit a they hit an organ just like Monarch does, so you have that extra thing going on, and that's part of the psych thing. But then everything gets stripped away. The Nebula is uh, Eddie Glass was formerly in a band called Fu Manchu. I'm sure oh, Fu Manchu! So yeah, he was in there for two albums, uh, and two of the best albums they've done. It would be this guy you're seeing tonight, Eddie Glass, uh, an enigmatic figure uh, to watch and be around. I'll just leave it at that. Beautiful. I enjoy him every time. Okay. So, yeah, that, it's going to be heavy, just straight, rocking desert motherfucker. You're going to enjoy this. Yeah. I love yeah. it. I love Have it. Have a drink of water or whatever you need, you know, and enjoy it. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you for letting us talk to you Thanks. and know more about your club. Well, thanks for right inviting me over tomorrow. Absolutely. Yeah, well, Absolutely. Yeah, I love what you're doing. They say Caius, and I'm like, I, I love it, love yeah. it. No, I mean, because not just because Caius, yeah. the whole thing is super cool. Yeah, yeah. Like, that's what I mean. Yeah. Caius thing's like, Bonus, this party. We've yeah. been doing this for about seven months and we've done over a thousand videos and reacted to 850 videos and reacted to a thousand songs. We've, we've been in contact, fans have contacted us, we've interviewed them, and we're just about promoting the beautiful plate of music that we all get to share and listen to and reap the, the gifts from these amazing artists. Yes. Yeah. Totally. Oh, you're singing for the same man book as me. Yeah. Got to help good music like this. Oh, yeah. It just it's it's there, man. Thanks, guys. Thank for everything. You. Thank cool. I'll see you guys a little bit. All right. So there you go. So we're here right from would be the horse's mouth, and uh, thanks for hooking us up with with him. Really appreciate that. Thank you. All right, you guys. Kel. Okay. We'll come back a little later. All right. Bye, guys. Rock and roll, baby. See you later. Thank you so much, Johnny. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.